Hello everyone, my name is Arcana Crows and welcome back to another episode of RimWorld. I don't really remember what we were doing last we left off, but I do know we have plans for this episode. More specifically, we are going to start building a hydroponics bay. Now, the thing here is that uh, we're just going to start with one. I've obviously marked here the outlines of a sun lamp. I'll actually show you. Uh, see, that's really the border of it because the hydroponics do need the sun lamps to help the plants grow. So uh, what I was doing was checking out our levels of stone blocks, of which we have more than enough. So I'll just go with your typical square because that will give me the corners to put um, the heater and batteries in. I'll go with steel in one of the corners so that will be around here, that's fine. No need to be centered. Uh, I'll remove this once the building is done. So hydroponics almost done. We do need to set research to be a bit higher. However, two people are already at the relatively high priority of research. So I don't know if we can really afford to have someone doing research full time. Or, you know, as a bigger priority. Uh, we also need this living room to get finished. More rice as well. Yeah, we are not going to be starving. Right after we get uh, our hydroponics done, we will get immediately started on machining and then gun turrets. Uh, not machining, sorry, microelectronics basics. Which will lead us to our gun turrets be essential for our defense going into the future. So, everyone is happy. And I am happy that everyone is happy. We'll also need a new storage area eventually. But for now this is good. Another thing I did notice. What have oh just failed construction. We do need a electri electric tailoring bench because we're still using the manual one and that's not good. Bad temperature, why? Because it's freaking cold, that's why. That's okay, we can solve that by putting a heater in. Mm, that would be a good place to put it. I mean, I guess... Uh, this is not really a good place, huh? It would be here! <laughs> well, we'll wait for this to be built and when we move it we'll add the heater. Guess we wait now. Also need to get start cremating. Can we even build? Not yet. We'll start cremating as soon as possible because that is getting ridiculous. Our hospital is chugging along, and chugging really is the right word there. How are we for wood on the map? Um, oh, here's some nice cactus. We can use those, grab all the wood they can provide, because we will definitely need that. Our little uh, Cecropia growing thing. Uh, not really going to make it to the winter. I don't think so. We better use the resources we have available in nature. Because that never goes wrong, does it? Chugging along, Blade and Fort Rob. Is anyone doing the research? 
No. Well, for Thrall, uh, you can actually have construction as a lesser priority. Yeah, that seems reasonable. So he'll... Oh dear! For Torben Taters. <sighs> and we have a raid to start the excitement. Uh, Silver Club, Bastille Knife, okay. The only problem here is all those um, shields. Let's see. Actually, I should just, you know, since I play modded, actually use my mods. So, Blade and Garrett, I would like you to grab the sniper rifle. Kristen, Fortrob, you know what you gotta do. Uh, Sean can come up here for now. And Batekazilla here. Please get into places. While they are slowly but surely making their way up here. I think they are making their way up here. No, they are preparing. So, Garrett. Stop resting and come hit people. Uh, oh, you only have them in your sights for a split second. Here we go. Try and keep everything on screen. Fail. Oh, and that's a 65% shot. You know, moving the cover of darkness really screwed the game up for the melee. Those shields really are saving them, but not too much. Ooh, this guy has medicine. Bam, one down. Three to go. Go, go, Garrett. Pew, pew, pew. It's too bad sniper rifles are so slow. Well, I guess they would be too overpowered if they weren't. Uh, are they really coming for him? No. Just looked like they were. Ha! Well, now they are. <laughs> uh, move it. Move, 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 move. Go, 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 go. Um, taters. Did Ray just stop there? Well, he did. Odd. Well, I did um, change my my RimWorld version to Alpha 17 briefly so I could test it. So that might not be helping things. Sean, move. Thank you. Blade and Batekazilla. Oh dear. I'll have to see if I can get things working out for us better. Because I don't know if you can see the slowdown that's happening right now. Hey, Kristen! Hmm. 
don't like what's happening there. sell it if we can't help out but no we absolutely cannot help out if that's how it goes go for it Rob I still do want you doing that blade I think everyone else except Garrett And the reason I keep switching Garrett back to a pistol is because you never know how when, how, when we're going to get into a fight that will require a more rapid response from him. Come on, Sean. You are our hero. Go, Sean. Everyone else is already too far. Yeah, I think this guy is gonna make it. Yeah, they're too fast. I'm not going to chase them down. I'm just going to get these unforbidden and let people go on about their lives. Those moods are not happy right now. Potegozilla is binging on Wake Up. Uh, do we have Wake Up? Guess not, since he went to sleep. <laughs> Punt. Uh, another thing we do want, but I will wait for... Uh, actually, looks like we already have the bricks. We're just waiting for the... And power. Okay, so I will make a small uh, medicine room. And this will have a glyph and some wooden doors. And we'll store medicine and body parts there. More granite blocks, that saves me on manpower. Really wish they'd finish this one, but okay. Everything is important. Fartrog is doing research. That's what I like to see. Things are going good right now. If, uh, well, blood everywhere, but yeah, what are you gonna do? People should be getting a legitimately comfortable soon. Maybe. This is a good armchair. Yeah, I guess there's just too much work to do. So let's give them some more. Election time. Let's see if we can't get people elected. Attending election. Carrot, go do your civic duty. Okie dokie then. I think there's enough people here to vote. Yes. New leader. Blade was elected as leader. Warrior. And Garrett was elected as leader. Botanist. I sense nepotism here. Not gonna lie. So, uh, minor. Remission. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Do I want to spend medicine? 
it's minor and it's in remission, so mm, he can suffer from cancer. Not the real one. The real one needs to be healthy. Okay, I'll remove that there. Can start setting up a heater there and a cooler there. And then we will do batteries around the corners here, on there as well. That should be enough to keep the whole system up. Maybe, maybe we can even do the solar generators here though. Enemies will be likely to attack them. Doesn't occupy any of the soil we were using for hay grass. Which is lovely. Car animals. Well, yeah. We don't have many animals right now, do we? No, wildlife. Uh, we have decent amounts of food, so we can tame these dromedaries, hunt those zibonas. Don't think it's worth hunting the rat. Why? Really? I definitely do not want y'all gathering there. But that is for now Tater's room. And I would like the these things built before I build her a new apartment. So I guess for now people are going to be uh, wandering around. Getting their... I guess I could put this closer. There we go. Just that for some reason they set this table as closer than this one. Which is incredibly weird. Now, do we have components? We probably. Oh, we have 56. Okay, no, never mind. We are fully capable of setting these things. Now. I, whoa! No. I want this to be at. Yep, 17. And thirteen. And that will be what we do for that. Now power will go all around the place. And into the workshop to connect to the main. As well as to the batteries and the solar panels here. Speaking of, we should probably add a few more here. A few more batteries never hurt anyone. Come on, Fort Rolf, we almost have our hydroponics. How's this bed? Normal! Uh, I guess so. I don't really have the wood to be... Oh, there we go, hydroponics. So now we can start on the microelectronics basics. And I think I'll wait for everything to be set up first before I uh, start setting up the, the light and whatnot. Dromedary, right. We need everything but apartments. And let's clear this part of it and the hospital and 
and well now that we have a stockpile just for them might as well not allow them in our outside crops yep uh, well that's a square that had nothing oh and of course the hydroponic basics basins I mean Yeah, rest of the place they can roam around as much as they want. I do not mind. Okay, so that is built, meaning we can export bills. Just tailoring bench. And we can deconstruct that one. Blade, uh, if you don't mind. And reinstall that here. Thank you, Bodegazilla. And import the tailoring bench I just created. And it should. Yep. All of our things here. Bulk goods trader. Nice. Now. Blade is still our best social, and with the leader buff, he sh has a trade price improvement of plus 10% over his normal thing. Let's trade that. Hello! What do you have for us? Another kitty? Ooh, huskies! Ooh. Ooh, tempting. No, we'll sell our America Scarab because I have no interest in a Mega Scarab. We will. I'll buy about 10 oysters because dry food. And we'll sell what? What can we sell? Not selling components because even though we have a lot of them, we'll kind of need them. We'll sell this alpaca wool, we have no need for that. Mega slot wool. Most of these we don't have a lot of use for them. We'll keep the dromedary ladder because it is plentiful and we are probably getting a lot more of it. But I'll sell everything else as much as I can. Keep the pig skin. There we go. Uh, tempted to buy their medicine even though it's expensive. Uh, crushed rocks, really? Oh, what I will do is buy their plasteel, in which case I'll also sell our pigskin. And I'll sell... Uh, 40? Yeah, 40 smoke leaf. And a few leaves. Some of these extra blocks, nothing, they're not doing anything here. Um, shoddy cloth, cloth fur coat, sure, why not? No, this I want to be uh, torn up. Uh, cloth t shirt superior, but a little bit used, poor, it can go away. Normal, poor. Yeah, I guess this is what we're getting then. Let me just do a quick double check. Yep. That's nice enough. Taters, do you mind holding the oysters because they decay? Thank you. No. This could be wood. Uh, but I guess we want to preserve our wood. Blade and Bodegazilla are starting their marriage ceremony in Kristen's bedroom. Amazing. I 
just perfect. <laughs> perfect. <laughs> ah, what a beautiful ceremony, so vengeful. <laughs> well, <laughs> and with that, <laughs> we are done for this episode. If you'd like to support the channel, please check out my Patreon. Pa uh, what? I mean, if you would like to support the channel, please consider becoming a Patreon patron. Anyway, please comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you next time.